You know, one of you ladies can sit on my lap. Okay, both of you ladies can sit on my lap. Finally, I've returned. Oh, my dear daughter, I could kiss you right now if I actually felt compassion. And I see she brought her little friends to help in the destruction of this world. I'm so proud. I'm so happy right now. What should I destroy first? How about New York? No. What about Japan? Wait, maybe Washington, D.C. The White House with the president. Boy, do I hate that Obama. Ooh, and these must be my minions to serve me. I shall call you by your new names. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Sir, everything has come to pass. I have done everything you have asked of me. Now can you grant the one favor I asked of you? That's right. You desire to be human once again. Well, only because I can't get too much Vogue movies when I look like this. Why would you want to be a pitiful human? It will seem very pointless once I rule this world and nothing is left but destruction and demons. If you choose to survive, it would be best that you stay where you are now. Why would I want a human working for me? Did you expect for everything in your life to go back to normal once I was released? So I'm stuck like this. Forever. Alright, so... They're around here somewhere. Skeets, were you able to find that program I installed in you from Cyborg to track down the Titans? I've already located them, Mr. Cord, and I'm just so excited to be a part of the mission. Oh, you're such a cute little robot thingy. Booster, I believe I am getting that sensation in my circuitry that you humans refer to as getting a boner. Alright, y'all. I'm, I'm putting, putting up a psychic, psychic link, link that, that way y'all don't have to talk out loud and the enemy won't be all hearing everything we're saying. Whoa, that's awesome! I didn't know you could do that. Me either. Then I started watching Young Justice. That little Martian girl do that all the time. Sir. I got a lock on their location. The Titans are just above that hill. I think I, think I, see, I see them, them. And, it and it looks, looks really, really red, red over there. there. Is that a good thing? Alright, I, I see, see them too. too. This, this ain't no good. good. The devil's over there, and he, he got, got their minds sprung. I'm gonna try to break through. through. Wait. Someone is here. City Martian. My mind can never be controlled. Attack them, you puny humans. Ah, oh, crap. I can see them coming after us. Plus, I can hear that demon guy. Dude has some kind of volume in his voice. Looks like it's gonna be blue and gold. All the way. In your face. Oh, no, I need more time to reach their minds. I will protect you, Sean. There's too many of them. I can't concentrate. Then it looks like I'll take the fight to them. I think we can take them. Yeah, this should be fun. Hey, Trigon, as a last request before we meet our demise, can you, like, you know, get fire and ice to finally make out? Ow! Fire? Hey, who's doing that? Wow, you guys suck without me. Red Arrow? I thought you was on drugs. Or rehab, or died. How'd you find us? Well, I got better. And Cyborg contacted me. Oh, and I brought some backup. Hmm. I trained a lot of these guys. I know all of their weaknesses. Great, but don't hurt them too badly. We just need to stall until Jean gets a hold of their minds. Team of superheroes fighting together, trying to save the world. They should really try to make a movie like that someday.